Hi guys, Kai here and welcome back. This is episode 12 of my FIFA 14 Arsenal career on the Xbox One. Uh, we're, we're doing good. We're nearly at the top of the league. I think Manchester United are at the top. I'm not sure. We'll check in a second. But for this first game, I've got to switch a few, a few players around. I've got a couple of injuries, I think, as well. I know Koscielny is still out. He's, he's out for ages. Um, this is... Capital One Cup, so I can put in my second string really. I'm gonna give Sonago a chance up front. Rest Suarez completely. Suarez isn't gonna, even gonna be on the bench for this one. Uh, give Walcott a rest. Put Alex Oxley Chamberlain in. Rosicki as Cam. And then we've got Flamini and Arteta in the central of midfield. So it's an away game against Sunderland. Hopefully, I won't live to regret this. Viviano's in, in goal as well. Going to give Chesney a rest for this one. So here we go. Sunderland versus Arsenal. Capital One Cup. I think this is the quarterfinals. And let's see how our second string do. Hopefully they do us proud. Give Snogo a chance. See if he gets a goal. Losing the ball early there. It's not how we wanted to start. So no goals in the first half. Not really had much chances. Uh, into the second, Sunderland are on the attack. A good challenge there from Murtasaka. Oh, but we've lost it again. And there's a chip ball over. And a volley. And Sunderland take the lead. 50 minutes played. Poor defending. And it's a nice chip over and a nice volley. A nice finish. Goalkeeper, no chance. 1 0 to Sunderland. So into the last minute of the game. Injury time, two minutes to go. Sonogo with the last chance. Can he equalise? Using his strength. Shoot. Oh, good save keeper. And it's gone for an Arsenal corner. This must surely be our last chance to equalise. Even the goalkeeper's running up. Viv Viviano's going up. Rosicki to take the corner. Swings one in. Ah, oh, no. Jack Wilshire. Shoot. Oh, good save keeper. Eight shots on goal we've had and we haven't scored. Sunderland have had two shots, scored one. And there goes the final whistle. We are out of the Capital One Cup in the quarter-final stage. I shouldn't really have played my second string, but I need them for the main games. We would have got to the final as well. We would have played Sheffield Wednesday in the semis. Tottenham are still in there. Wigan beat West Brom. I've got to say, it looks like Tottenham are going to win the cup. Transfer budget edition, eight and a half grand. Thanks. I'm not really going to do much with that. International management offer from Sweden. No, thank you. And another one from Scotland again. I reject that one as well. Maybe next season I'll take an international job. I want the in the England job. Or well, big game next up. Paris Saint Germain in the Champions League. We're, whoever wins this game will go through to the next round so it's a big big game a draw will make us finish second so we need to put our first team players back in Rosicki out Ozil in put Giroud there for now Paul Pogba in for Flamini or Arteta even where's Jack Wilshire there we go Jack Wilshire's back in so the team is ready and we're at home so fingers crossed get the three points or at least a draw and we're through to the knockout stages of the Champions League We've got Giroud starting hopefully he can get a goal thought I'd give him a chance because Suarez is going to be playing a lot more after this PSG going to kick us off and get the action on the way good early challenge there from Giroud Bully him a bit, early pressure. And no goals in the first half. And he was completely through there. Just over an hour played. Good uh, goalkeeping from Chesney. Will shot on the ball, cut it inside, ball over the top. She's rude, good control, shoots. Oh, it's a fantastic finish, great goal. A beautiful goal. Uh, 
assist from Jack Wilshire. We even got an achievement for that. Beautiful control from Giroud and a nice finish to pull us in front. Look at that ball, what control. Bang, right foot. Goalkeeper, no chance. So it's Arsenal 1, PSG 0, 20 minutes to play. On the attack again, straight away. Ozil over the top. Giroud, oh, he's almost through again. So into the last minute of the game, just one minute of injury time to go. It looks like we're going to get the three points, but we're on the final attack on this left side with Cazorla. And that's enough. The, go the referee blows his whistle. We get the win, and that means we're through to the knockout stages of the Champions League. I think we finished second in the group stage. There's the current Premier League. We're a game in hand of Man United, who are top. And we're just five points off them. Liverpool in second, Fulham in fourth, surprisingly. Still got the FA Cup to play yet. And there's the Capital One Cup, which we lost. So the group stages. Man United and Dortmund look like they're both going through. Barcelona through easily. Man City join them as well. Schalke looks like they're going to win that group. Real Madrid finished top in hours. Arsenal second. PSG going to the Europa League stage. Galatasaray didn't even win one game. Chelsea finished top in theirs. Milan second. Bayern Munich finished top in theirs as well. Leon. Unlucky to miss that. 